Let's send these guys home. I'm gonna detach our trade ships. So we're gonna, where's the create new unit button? There we go, they keep moving stuff around on me. We're gonna give them the Admiral and they're gonna go protect trade wherever is most profitable. Indus, actually. Haas is no longer a valid rival. We have eclipsed them. So, Fars. Wow, look at <laughs> look at all this shit going on over here. Uh, yeah, we'll rival Fars. It's a Fars, and we're not gonna rival Timurids. So, where is Musa? Mushasha. Oh, they're up there. Yeah, we'll rival them. Why not? Gonna core our stuff. I guess we didn't have to core either of these because we already had a core on them. So that's cool. Wonder if we could have taken an extra province. I forgot to look. Drill this army. So our next... Well, let's see. When can we annex Oman? I mean, it's going to be a while, but... February 1457 is is uh, ostensibly the first time we could do it. Mission selected. Uh, let's see. The, we, we don't... We, like, we can't convert anything right now, which is annoying. Bahrain. We control some of it. Yeah, let's go ahead and make it a state. Which means that the Ulema want land. Which could actually be good for us, because it'll, it'll help us convert things. So let's see, where... What is our most troublesome province? Suhar is currently our most troublesome province. Can we give that to the Ulema? No, because the nobility already own it. Um, Muscat is our next most troublesome province. So we will grant that to, uh, to the Ulema, I think. I know there's an Estates button on this, but I can never freaking find it. Um, okay, they're happy. They're actually very happy, and that should allow us to convert that province, I think. Naj wants military access, that's fine. Mara is no longer a valid rival. All right, so let's start converting Muscat to Sunni. Lost the Humiliate, yep, all that stuff. So I guess we don't really have any other valid rivals at the moment. <laughs> Except the Timurids. Let's see how this war shakes out. Let's, let's put a pin in that. <laughs> Let's put a pin in it. What do you guys say? Alright, well I guess we could start planning the conquest of Mara. Aden, Hassa, and Yemen. Hassa, I don't know if Hassa can join them right now. Because they have a truce with us, but I don't know if that changes if it's a defensive war. Oh cool, we got a really good air. Um, yeah, Hassa couldn't join. Mostly because they're in debt. Aden is down here. Yemen is pretty small as well. Um, what is the general... What? what how, how are people feeling about us? Like someone... Someone like Baluchistan. Okay, Ag Expansion really hasn't gotten out of control yet. So I think we could start conquering the Gulf of Aden. So I'm going to put a spy network here. I 
Good thing is, okay, the Renaissance has popped up in where? Urbino, okay. So it's gonna take a while to spread to us, so we'll probably develop in order to spread it. Um, so this is our capital, which is in the Mogostan area. Which is actually mostly on the other That's interesting. So we actually do need to take some land from the Timurids if we want to uh, have full use of our capital state. I didn't realize that, actually. Maybe we should have rivaled the Timurids. Yeah. Unless we decide to just give up this province and put our capital somewhere on the Arabian Peninsula. I'd almost prefer that, like move our capital to Muscat, maybe. It's a coastal center of trade. Drylands are development cost plus five. Coastal desert plus thirty-five. Eh, we want to hang on to Hormuz. That's a much better province. Okay. Um. Well, let's go ahead and pass an edict here. Development cost. Feudal de jure law. Oh, we could pass a missionary strength edict down here, actually. Force religious unity. Yeah. Gonna be losing money now, but. Not for long. Um, yeah, so let's see if we can force this institution to spawn. Um. All the 28. Build up our capital, which is always good. All right. Now mission selected. Now let's take the manpower reserves one. And we're going to continue to drill our army. In the meantime, are these barks? Yes, they are. Protect trade in the Indus. Go merge with our other thing. Transoxiana has announced Timurids as their new rival. Oops, didn't mean to do that just yet. That's alright. Gained a core province. Profiteering in Masira. The citizens of Masira have grown tired of the local influence of greedy Najdi merchants that they claim are using unfair advantages to outcompete local businesses. They demand that we step in to limit the influence of foreign traders on the area and reaffirm the privileges of our own merchants and artisans. If we do not act, they might take matters into their own hands. So this would make Najd like us a lot less. Um, we get more trade power, but less goods produced. Uh, this gives us unrest. Yeah, I think competition is good for everyone. We're not going to be blatantly protectionist yet. Also, is their new rival? You know what? I've been doing this in the wrong order. That's why we ran out of admin power so fast. I should have been alternating admin, then diplo, then admin, then diplo. Oh, cool! I actually didn't know that could happen. <laughs> of course he improved his maneuver, the thing that he was already high in, and did not gain any stats in his ones that are shitty that we need him to improve in. Mara wants military access. You're not going to have it. Speaking of Mara... Uh, let's see. Three, 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 three. All of your provinces suck, so it doesn't really matter which one we fabricate on. 
We're just gonna do Wooster because that's the one that's closest to us. Question is, is now the time to strike or do we want to wait for our manpower to build back up? Let's say hypothetically that we pull the diplomat out of here. We'd still be fighting Yemen and Aden. Let's see. Two, two, two in manpower. Three, three, two in manpower. And these guys are just shitty. Would any of our allies join? I don't think they would. Yeah, okay, Oman would join, and they're our vassal. But they're, they're still disloyal. Let's stop drilling. Farce. Let's see here. I feel like this might be a good time to strike. Um, oh, we can build up our army a little bit. That makes it a little bit of an easier decision. Let's build up to our force limit, then we'll go after them. So, eight. So, yeah, we are going to be maintaining a higher cavalry army than I normally would, just because we're in the Muslim tech group. I should probably be paying attention to this separatist shit, shouldn't I? Um... Can we afford to boost our stability right now? Yeah, I'm gonna harsh treat these guys. Yeah, absolutism doesn't matter because we're <laughs> we're too early in the game for it to matter. Yeah, I'd, I'd rather get the institution. Royal marriage from Oman. Let's do it. Can you tell your dudes to stop wanting independence? All right, I'm going to keep enough military power in the bank to do harsh treatment again if we need to. Mystics and storytellers, we're going to ban the offensive stories because we're all about that legalism. We're going to start our own renaissance, as we are often want to do. Someone declared war on Hassa, which also has huge... Oh, they conquered Najd, and now they've got separatists all up, up in the place. Man, do we have- we don't have any overextension, do we? I guess we don't, no. Alright, well let's continue to train Muslim cavalry. In case we do have to put down a rebellion. Hassa... That Hassa? No, you can't have military access. You're a rival. Why, why would you think? What would make you think that that would be something that we would find acceptable? Yeah, we might honestly just have to rebel hunt for a little while here. Lack of protection, um, they need to adapt, I think, is my response to that. Come on, Renaissance. Get that tasty renaissance. Normalization of relations between the Maliki and the Jafari. For some time, the relationship between the Maliki and Jafari have been strongly colored by distrust and conflict. Some scholars have gone as far as to denounce the theologians of the other school and their followers. However, tensions have been greatly lessened in recent years, and with Hormuzi, Maliki, and Farsi Jafari scholars leading the way towards tolerance and coexistence. All right, so we don't hate these guys' version of religion as much anymore. Uh, we have, we're going to maintain our diplomat in Oman. They actually like us now. Not enough for us to annex them, but, you know, that's coming. Foreign th theologians enliven scholarship. The theologians we invited to our country have come to greatly enrich local religious scholarship. They've left their mark upon the country and inspired a new generation of ulema. Um, so you can move towards... Legalism, and we get a Bedouin Sunni theologian at our court. 
which is cool, or they'll find their places throughout the country, which gives us admin power, which we need more right now. All right. Then we'll spend our last little bit of money on more infantry. Our last little bit of force limit, I should say. Conversion successful, finally. <laughs> 208 months for, uh... All right, well, we'll get working on it. Religious unity helps a lot. Actually, that should have greatly decreased our unrest. Because we went from, like, 14% religious unity to, like, over 50%. Mamluks have declared war on Hassa. Hassa's just getting shit on all over the place. Okay. Well, how close are we to having a rebellion? Six years. Um. Hmm. Yeah, let's go ahead. Let's take some provinces off of them. They control part of an area we want, so... We'll, we'll just take the rest of the Dofar area. Declare war. Hassa still wouldn't join. Yemen and Aden would. Now, it's a tough call. It's a tough call if we want to do this right now. Uh, yeah, let's just do it. <laughs> Lost recovering economy. That's gonna become a meme on the Lore Sworn Order. Rival of our rival is Ajam. They're way over here somewhere, aren't they? Oh yeah, they're this little guy up here. Timurids are just not having a good day. Lost the trade protection CB against Vigianagar. So there's that. Okay, there's the Maran army. Let's let's go kill them real quick. Quest for military access from the Mamluks? Sure. I could see staying on good terms with the Mamluks being a smart midterm goal. We will eventually want to take the Alexandria node from them, but, uh, you know, until then. Well, they marched all the way across the desert to take one province from us, and now they're running away. So this is going to be super annoying. Because now here come comes Auden down here. This is why waging war in the Arabian Peninsula is a little bit iffy. They only have one-star generals? Okay. As the state and its bureaucracy grow, there's an ever-growing need of people to oversee administration and administrate various lands and functions. The emirs have traditionally been more associated with military service. Okay. Um, so... Let's take a look at our states. Um, the, uh, the ones that are in danger of low loyalty are the merchants and the emirs. Um, so the Ulema we could afford to lose some loyalty with. Merchant guild, so the merchant guilds lose 20 loyalty, emirs lose 20 loyalty. Hmm. I think we're going to stay with the Noble Counselor. And then we'll grant them some Monopoly Charters to 
make them not so annoyed with us. All right, so if we can catch their single stack and win, yeah, even if their reinforcements filter in at this point, we should be good. Yeah, that was actually the best thing that could have possibly happened. <laughs> Yeah, now we gotta run. Come on, I'm on. Where where are you even Are you disloyal? What's your attitude towards us? Loyal? Okay, then stay with our army. If you're loyal, then act like it. You gotta stay with us. We're not going to accept any excuses. We're going to come pick you up, and then you're going to come help us kill shit. That's how this is going to go. You're not going to stand around. You're not going to wander off. There we go. I'm going to attach. We're going to kick these guys' asses. They're going to run off. We're going to try to catch him out here. Seriously taking a shitload of casualties versus what I feel like we should be taking. Uh, we will we will grant them their aid. And we're going to capture these dang provinces. And then we're going to try to end this war. <laughs> before we take any more casualties. So we have the war goal. The war goal is ours. Agent was discovered. Normalizations between the Maliki and the Ismaili, all right. I don't know that the Ismaili are people I necessarily want to be friends with. But, uh... Yeah, we don't want to be friends with the Jam. They're weak. They're weak sauce. Their sauce is weak. We don't want it. Casey is groaning in the background because she doesn't want to be friends with the Ismailis either. Oh... All right. This has been a little bit more of a of an annoying war than I expected it to be, but uh, let's see if we can piece them out at this point. No, no piece out at this point. Okay. <sighs> Would they take a white piece? At this point, I don't care. See if we can get one more month tick. Yeah, we need a white piece. That was a bad, bad idea for a war. Um, we did not have the manpower for it 